with me and Anna Griffin's joining us. Making something beautiful gives you a sense of purpose and, and fulfillment that really no other pastime can. Whether it's card making or woodworking even, we all have inside of us the ability to make things and do things and produce things. And crafting is just about bringing that out. People love that satisfaction of making things. It's very important that you can achieve what I can achieve, and I make it easy for you to do that. I don't remember a time when I wasn't crafting. I don't know anything different but to craft. All right, you're watching HSN. I'm Suzanne Runyon, and we have a big day of crafting in store for you. Uh, let's get started. Uh, Miss Anna Griffin's going to be joining me. I'm super excited about that. Uh, but let me give you a preview of an item coming up in fact, two items coming up in our show uh, that I know you're gonna love. We have lots of brand new as well. We've got some favorites coming up as two. What am I doing? Where's my preview, Sierra? So why am I standing over here then? <laughs> Sierra's, okay guys, it's live TV, we love it. I'm doing this one and this one, thank you, Sierra. Okay, here we go. First item to preview. Uh, we, we love, 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 love when Anna does her paper kits. They sell out every single time we do them. We cannot keep them in stock and she has put together a fantastic design. It has 24 sheets of your cardstock, two of each design, and then another 12 sheets of the vellum, the matching vellum to go with it. This is glorious and I love it because it's just a completely different look than you normally see from Anna. You're like, wait a minute, where are all the flowers. This is more of, um, I would say, um, gender-friendly design. It's also more masculine design. And for me, I have a bunch of guys in my life, so I always get excited on those. And, and it, quite frankly, it's pretty rare that Anna does more masculine papers, but look at how beautiful this is. Can you imagine how gorgeous your project is gonna look using this kit? So that is coming up. The next I wanna show you is over here, and I love this too. This one is um, our Crop at Home number three scrapbook frame dies. Now, for me, it's more than just scrapbooks, but we never want to forget scrapbookers because that's kind of the heart and soul of where all this paper crafting started. What you're getting are all the dies that you see here from the smallest ones to the bigger sizes to really cover those big scrapbook pages. Or of course, if you wanted to use them for card making, for tags, for just beautiful decor. I'll tell you, one of the most used ones you'll use in this set is concentric rectangles. You, you would not believe how many things you can do with those concentric designs just to give that scrapbook or certainly that um, note that you're making a lot of pop and a lot of wow. So how great is that value? It is coming up and it is our weekly deal drop. That is incredible for all these beautiful quality dies that you're getting in the set. So that is coming up. All right, where am I going first? I'm going over here, very good, brand new. And I, will, I called this on my notes, rare. Brand new and rare. And you're just seeing a little smattering of what you're getting in the kit in front of me. But this one's really, really fun. Well, Father's Day is not too far away. You've got that special dad in your life. And we have what's called the Simply Father's Day card making kit. You're gonna make 12 great cards out of this and she always gives you extra embellishments. And Anna, of course, is joining me. She's known in the stationary world, the quilting world, the sewing world. She's known in scrapbooking world. She's known in card making making world, it, well, basically anything creative. That's why we love Miss Anna Griffin. And she joins me from Atlanta in her studio. Hi, honey, it's good to see you again. Hi, nice to see you. That You made me sound like a Marvel hero. I love that, all those worlds. Uh, well, thank you, you are to us. You absolutely are. You're, you're our superwoman. <laughs> awesome, awesome. Well, you know, what's so exciting, Suzanne, I know that you also say that, that there's one time of year where we really pull out all the stops yep. for the men in our lives and we create products just for them. So that cart home, a uh, paper kit, beautiful, brand new, but this, we, you know, we are seasonally appropriate. We push the season. This is our Simply uh, Father's Day card making kit. And what's inside this box is over 100 pieces to make 12 three-dimensional cards plus twine. And when you're thinking about making a card for a dad or, you know, like this might be your son who has your uh, children, like, wishing you a happy Father's Day is what we want to say. But 
in this card kit, we've also given you what to say on the inside. So the cards are pre-printed. They're already die cut. You're really, you're getting adhesive on the inside of this kit so that everything that you need to make what you see is here. So what's unique about that, Suzanne, is that not only do you not have to have a machine or a scissors or glue, you just have to have the will, right? I always say it's it's a difference between will or skill, right? And if you have the will that you want to create really special cards for him this year, this kit is perfect for you. Now, we're going to look quickly at how easy it is. We've designed this into in a, a, a system where it mixes and matches really simply. You choose a card base and then you choose a, a card layer and all the cues are already there, meaning that they're double-sided layers. They have foil on most of them, and everything works uh, like, you know, you we were making, you were, it was all on purpose. Now, here is where we get into things that are all antique ephemera. They are 3D stickers. We have um, themes for music and themes for old cars and golf and all the things that he might enjoy. And then we have, you know, Happy Father's Day. It said in so many different ways. But even if you wanted to send a card that says world's greatest dad, not on Father's Day, you can do that with this kit. So a little creativity goes a long way with the twine. But we put this together in individual bags and boxes, well, bags of, of embellishments. And you get, you actually get the... Um, envelopes with it as well. So everything, like I said, you put this in front of, let's say your kids, right? You're, you're at home and you're thinking, all right, what are we going to do tonight? Well, we're going to get a jump on the Father's Day uh, cards because look at this. It's so simple and it's really fun because we take all the guesswork out of it by giving you things that mix and match. And yes, it's all in, in that old world type of style, but we We've really made it modern by giving you the things that you wanted to say on the inside, sending you lots of love on this special day. And so it's so cheers to you, Dad. I hope you know I'm grateful and my heart is truly glad that today and every single day I have you as my dad. Isn't that fantastic? So, Sus uh, Suzanne, I think you've got a lot of people that you would give these to, right? The, it's super simple. Is sending you right, lots of love on this personal day. So again, while she's crafting, watch. I'm going to literally, with ne I have never seen this kit. So yes, it's all happening live on the air. I've never seen the kit before. And you're going to see Anna and I both working. And again, the fun part about this is you're just grabbing elements. Like look how cool this gramophone is. And then I've got some pieces of sheet music here. So maybe you have a dad who loves music, right? Maybe you have somebody in your life who is just, you know, into that. Um, let me grab, oh, I kind of, I love this ephemera too. Because honestly, you guys, you don't have to really think about it too much. Oh, here, we got records. Oh, that's cool. We're going to kind of go old and new. <laughs> now, look what's happening, you guys. I've never seen this kit before. It's the first time because it's brand new. I'm working with it. And look at this. I am literally putting together one of the coolest cards, right? with no, well, I have experience, but it doesn't matter. You need no experience to make this work. And voila, look how fast I put that card together. Like that is so easy and fun. And I think that's what you'll really enjoy about it. Anna is so brilliant along with her team at putting together kits that come together quickly without zero experience. And Anna, I really love it when you do that because now everybody can look like they know what they're doing with absolutely no experience. And I love the whole theme of these Simply kits because it makes it easy Me for too. everyone. Right, that, that's the actual, the impetus behind the entire product design was how do, we, 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 we love craft days on HSN, number one. But when you are just starting out, right, you, you want, you have the need to make something, but you don't have 
want a lot of time. You don't have, you don't want to invest in a lot of different equipment. Right. Having a Simply Card Kit, you're going to make 12 unique cards with this, and everything's here, including the adhesive. So when we're making something for the first time, I make it so simple, where you're just starting out. This is the adhesive that's included. It's little foam adhesive, and then everything that's in the kit is an actual sticker. So you can just peel off the back and create um, this kind of collage. And I love it because we've included all those themes, right? So so um, maybe dad's into reading or there's a briefcase or, you know, the waistcoat and the watch so that like we're keeping time. Or, you know, there's a sports fan in the house. This is the kind of card kit that will last way past Father's Day because of the style of the things that are included inside. So it is really a one, two, three, incredible 3D experience, right? So you're picking a card, you're adding a layer, you're deciding some embellishments, you're adding a sentiment, and the palette of this, and everything's in included on the inside, so so lucky to have you as my father. Then if you, if you wanted to make this into a birthday card, very easily you could, you know, change this with uh, just the change of a sentiment. So happy Father's Day, very simple to work with. Uh, wishing you all the best today and every day, that is more of a generic statement. So if you're thinking, all right, well, I don't need to make 12 Father's Day cards, <laughs> this kit is Smart. actually going to work for all the other things, right? You wanna say, you wanna say to the people in your life, how much you appreciate them, right? And especially those gentlemen. Okay, so the palette, like I said, is it's it's beautiful. So it's blues, like a denim blue, a beautiful sage green, and a, a lot of gold accents. So you see that gold foil just uh, flickering there in the light. And I think what's so nice about each one of these is that if you love uh, trophies or top hats and champagne, everything is included. We go through, like I said, at the top of this, there are over a hundred different pieces in the set to make all these collage elements. So we're thinking, you know, we've given you everything that you need to play and enjoy uh, this. And let me just show you, this, this is a compound embellishment. So these come this yeah, these way cool. where it's multi multiple layers and then when on the back all you do is you take your finger and you just flick the that uh removable adhesive cover off the back you don't wreck your nails um <laughs> and it's so easy right so now it just sticks on to the card and you can find other elements inside the kit that are going to go with this golf thing the theme and really this is as simple as it can be look at I how fun this is well, and yes, like my and husband's a huge sports fan, Anna, so I really appreciate that you covered that. But look, this is just the card itself, and you put one element down. Maybe that's your speed. You're like, okay, that's cool. I mean, it looks great, right? Isn't this shocking that a card could look that good with so little effort? But if you want to get fancier, obviously, you just start grabbing layers. And you don't, don't get too worked up with, oh, it's got to go here. It's got to be perfect. No. Whatever you do with Anna's kit, trust me, people will be in awe of how fabulous the card looks, even if you make it consider kind of basic. Uh, you don't have to worry about it. That's what these, I think these kits are so much fun because again, they're fast, they're simple, they're really, really easy. And I super hope that I can encourage those of you who say, oh, I don't know how to craft. I can't, I've never done anything like that before. Please don't worry. Just grab this and you'll make the neatest cards that any guy in your life will be thrilled. Look what I did, Anne. I didn't particularly like that mm -hmm. route. So I just grabbed the stars and put it on there. And voila, that could be exactly. the end of my card right there. Right, and you're getting more than you need to make yeah. a, a highly mm -hmm. embellished card. And so with your, with, if you start out, we, we like a rule of thumb in our Simply Card series that you can use four pieces plus your sentiment on each card. That's how we build them. We build them with you in mind. We give it to you in a way that you don't have to know how. And we give you an instruction sheet uh, inside each one of these boxes. And so you see, we've, we've done the collage for you. Uh, all 12 cards are here, and this is folded up in that packaging. And one of the things I was showing you, Suzanne, was that it comes in this, incredible box, but one of the things about it is that all cards can go back in. 
and you can save them for when it's time to send. But then all you have to do is sign the back. It says handmade by. I like it that you, you know, you get credit for creating such beautiful works of art. And there, there's that foam adhesive. So you want to get these in the mail and start thinking about dad right now. Isn't that lovely? All right, so stay right there for that. I know we've already sold a couple hundred of those kits. That's 100% brand new. And you tonight are the first ones to see it. Now, when Anna's here, realize Throughout the day, we will have multiple, multiple sellouts. So that's a kit that I wouldn't wait too much longer on, only because it's one of those rare times where she does go all out and kind of strays from her traditional florals and, and does a more masculine look, which is wonderful if you've got a lot of guys in your life. All right, really quickly, I just want to show you this because I thought this was so darn clever. This is just back in stock. It's now available for $36.95. It is the cutest way to be able to display your cards. It actually is a kit that's designed to make card stands. So you get these amazing intricate dies to create these wonderful stands that you see down here. Isn't that fun? Also notice too, because I haven't mentioned it, we have four flex pays all this hour on everything. And I do want to also mention, it is $7.50 to ship your entire crafting order today. Why is it a big deal? Well, number one, I know you love that. I get more emails and more comments like, what kind of shipping deal are you gonna have? So you will spend no more than $7.50 to ship all your crafting goodies today. You can check out multiple times, no problems there. Just keep checking out and have fun all day long to get that special shipping rate that's for the next about 23 hours. So certainly take advantage of that. Also, if you wanna see our entire craft event, you can see lots of ideas and crafting um, items and different things to order, but have fun today and kind of go crazy. Fill that card up multiple times and check out and you will spend no more than $7.50 to ship everything. All right, so whenever Anna does her paper kits, they are massively popular. We wait for them, we anticipate them, and she has absolutely knocked this one out of the park. It's a combination of the most gorgeous printed vellums and the most beautiful foiled cardstock, once again, in a more masculine collection in this. So if you guys wait on her card, um, cardstock sets, this is another one that we're launching in tonight's show. So Anna, I love this. You took these beautiful, deep, rich colors, and then I love the fact you now added vellum to this collection. Right, we call, we call this cart home, and that is everything, a card designed for him. And we, you're getting 12 by 12 acid-free card stock and 36 sheets in total in the set. And one of the things that's so pretty uh, is the design behind each one. And it, it, it's like, so this is a foulard pattern, right, that you would see on a men's necktie. And you see that the paper is foil stamped in uh, with the red and the gold. But then what we've done is we've given you combinations of textures that you might find in uh, men's uh, suiting or shirts. And so we have a herringbone texture. We have a linen texture. This is this is so subtle. It's, a, it's, it's like a taupe. Really pretty. And then we have, um, you know, pretty for a guy. So <laughs> we have a, a, a plaid and we have a hound's tooth. And these patterns are, you're getting two of each of the designs that I'm showing you but we've designed this in a way that even when you've got this this uh, linen on a diagonal in the ivory or you're working with the brown and the navy once again you see these incredible things that we put together uh, that work for just about all of the projects so if you're if you love to scrapbook this is definitely a cardstock collection that you will find very easy to include those pictures of of dad and granddad and and your son and and uh, your uncle, and here we go. The vellum works the same way. It's the same patterns, but the vellum is also foil stamped. So this is really high quality vellum. The cardstock is 230 GSM, and this is a 200 um, GSM vellum. So when when you know it's, it, you can see my hand through that, right? It's a translucent paper. It has this gore. It's like a, a gossamer kind of effect. But I think when we foil stamp it, we end up with just a whole different way of looking at paper and this you know I'll show you in uh, some of the projects that we've made that it's really simple to include like this wonderful ticking stripe 
So the ticking stripe, you know, you, you see how it overlays like an ivory card. It just gives you a different texture on, on creating something like this from scratch. But if you love, if you love to work with paper like I do, um, fussy cutting, the card stocks is going to give you a, a really nice look. And then if you like to make uh, any of your die cutting dies, you, you cut pattern paper, you end up with a, a completely different look. So we saw these as solid but then here it is on, on a card. So I'm gonna work with this really quickly, Suzanne, just to show you how easy it is to, to you, you know, use the vellum. The, so there's the houndstooth vellum on top of the plaid with the little foulard pattern. And then we, um, we used our concentric dies to create just a layer. And then if we go back to those embellishments that were in the Simply uh, Father's Day card making kit and add a little happy Father's Day sentiment, we now have a card from scratch where we keep all those things going. So anytime you buy a card kit from you've got leftovers well it's easy to add them to something like this where we're starting from scratch so a, a pretty card base again cutting the card stock with the with any of the dies in your craft room is really going to get you a lot of neat things um the, oh these are coming up later today there's a lot of things on for him um in our craft day today on hsn S suzanne i know you're going to love the fact mm -hmm. that we've got some cut and emboss folders nice. um, um, to to create some shirts and hats and all kinds of things for dad. So oh, cute. it's it's so it's all it's all it's going to start with the best paper, right? You want to create the best foundation right. for okay, what you're working with. Okay, wait a minute. That shirt with. is so cute. I can't stand it. That jacket. <laughs> um, is that with <laughs> it's the a suit? Uh, th this is with the cardstock, oh, and um, so but this is our cart home uh, die set. This was a craft <gasps> box that we um, made for HSN. Stop it. Uh, the I'm pretty sure that those dies are, are probably still available. Um, oh, and so you see how cutting those gorgeous colors, this was, I worked really hard on getting the right brown because I think it, it prints kind of funny on our ivory cardstock. And so this is a really rich sort of chocolate brown. It's really lovely. And then the red, white, and blue, uh, perfect color palette for him that yeah. you can, this is gonna mix really well, whether you're creating rosettes or layers you know on your cards. If you're making cards to a member of the military, that's really a beautiful way to do a red, white, and blue as opposed to the traditional bright red, white, and blue. Exactly. Well, and everything that we do, you know, has a little age to it. It's mm -hmm. got, you know, a darker effect, you know, sort of, um, you know, most everything that we work with is from my archive. And so, so those are 18th century kinds of things, early 19th century, uh, beautiful old world things. So I, I like to stick to a perfect palette. That's what we call it. Um, and the perfect palette for him really does start with some of these papers. So let's make something again, because you're getting 36 sheets and so if you're creating a card surface from scratch that's really easy die cutting again uh your new found favorite paper kit uh, is really awesome and here look at this we've had little um embellishments cut from the vellum um, from one of our flower die sets and this is lovely because it's going to um just overlay the that which is beneath it and so we want those to actually show i think and so here we're just going to build from the bottom up and once again if you are, have any of our collage card toppers you'll see how this color palette does mix and match with everything in our line that pertains to the men in your life all right, guys, so whenever Anna, I gotta repeat this, she brings out her massive cardstock kits. Everybody scoops them up. Because it is, it's an incredible value. So remember, you're getting 24 of the 12 by 12, and they're beautiful heavyweight cardstock. You're getting 12 12 by 12 sheets of the vellum, two of each of the designs. This is one of those things that I think you get, and I'm a paper hoarder. I am I like I love paper so much, and I have tons of Anna's papers and her cardstocks, but this one is such a nice variety. It gives you more options 
options when it comes to designing. And that is why I think it's so appealing. Maybe you use this for just regular card making. We don't necessarily have to be a guy's card, right? But it does give you a different look. And Anna, I really like that kind of variety. You know, obviously I have a ton of your florals because that's what you do most of the time. But I do have, you know, I have some of your Father's Day or the more, more masculine themed items because I got guys in my life, you know, and they don't want a girly florally card. So this is that rare instance where you actually can get um, beautiful cardstock and beautiful vellums that uniquely made that will give you that variety that I think we search for when it comes to designing scrapbook pages or cards or what have you. All right, stay there for that one. Again, this is a massive collection of these beautiful 12 by 12 sheets. Do not miss out on that before it is sold out. Hey guys, I hope you can check out my Facebook group. There's a, so many people have now joined it. There's actually, we just hit the 7,000 member mark, so I'm super proud of that. And what makes this group so neat is an extension for my Tuesday night Facebook shows that we do every single Tuesday night. What I love about it is you guys would always see what my guests were doing, what I was doing. Actually, Anna was my guest last Tuesday night when we took the network over. That was so much fun. But we can now see what you're doing. So you guys are posting all your fun projects, and every Tuesday night, I do feature projects that you've made on the Tuesday night Facebook show. Tonight, that show, because again, Facebook Live only, is going to be at 9.30 p.m. East Coast time. There's someone who introduced herself by showing her puppy dog, which I thought was really cute. <laughs> All right. Oh, there's another doggy picture. How cute is that? It's really a fun place. I hope you can join us. And you find out all the events coming up and all the things we've got going on. All right, this next item I love, 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 love. And it's called our weekly deal drop. On Mondays, we drop exclusive deals that you can only get for one week. Or obviously, if they sell out early, it's done. This is our weekly deal drop from Anna. So this is going to be on a couple times this week. And it's a beautiful choice. And I can't believe how great this value is. You actually are getting these gorgeous frames. It says for scrapbook for sure we love that but obviously it's for card making tag making gift whatever you're doing and they're all concentric um anna first and foremost thank you for doing just the rectangles because i have found just getting concentric shapes are one of the handiest dies you could ever own yeah, yeah, and there's a set of 10 of them right there. They are designed to go uh, behind all of those frame dies that are all the decorative ones. You're getting three different sets of the decorative frames. There, there are 12 of those. And this is what you're able to accomplish with those dies. Wow. You were able to create these fancy edges oh. They uh, with three different sizes. Uh, and then they're designed to, uh, the, the, the rectangle, Tangle ones are designed to cut the photos and the background. So you see how we've used them to illuminate the journaling or the title behind a photo. And then those concentric dies come back in here with those solid shapes. Awesome. This is a very simple way to create scrapbook pages. And we've right. done them specifically for, um, for you uh, today where you can take these and, and uh, expand or use them as uh, embellishments on these pages. And I, each one of these is so beautiful. But this is where the smaller ones of the concentric frames were designed for the titles. Mm -hmm. And then you can mat the photo or you can um, put the photo right on top. And I'm gonna show you what that means. So with each one of these, the design of the, the decorative frame, this is our rounded corner frame and this is the concentric ones. And the rounded corner, Corner, it's going to actually create a so beveled pretty. edge in the center of it and you it'll, it, it gives you a place to line up a four by six photo each one of the, the them is different and so you see how the four by six fits behind each one of those so it's lace and it's uh, scallop and uh, a rounded corner and I've spent the last three days straight talking about these uh, because we hosted a scrapbooking event uh, that we uh, <laughs> offered here on HSN, which was amazing. And we made so many incredible projects. But here, I would I would encourage a card maker to look at these as incredible layer dies mm -hmm. for their cards. So a full five by seven, and then the three by five, and the four, and then the even smaller. So they graduate in size. So if you're if you're thinking about, uh, all right, I want something new to decorate with, these are very versatile. 
phenomenal, uh, not just for scrapbooking. All right, so I'm gonna show you how easy they are to cut. Um, I'm using my Empress machine and uh, the, my large plate system. And so the concentric dye becomes the background behind the, sh it's a shadow layer for the frame. We're gonna cut this out of solid paper just so that you can see it clearly. And the, these are uh, our standard dye, you know, the one millimeter powdered coated steel. They are second to none in the world. They will work in any machine that you have, uh, electronic or otherwise, but our Empress machine is, uh, it just it's a workhorse. It's an electronic cutting machine. Um, and here, here we go. We have um, that, which is beautifully done. And then you would take the little uh, background. Now, again, this looks like a card layer, but this is what you would do. Oh, you would pretty. weed that cut just a little bit. And now you have, this would be, uh, for me, this makes a great thank you note, stationary, mm. um, and, and then a photo can go right on top. So it's that simple. I'm gonna make a, a scrapbook page for you um, with that die, and let me just show you kind of how that would work. We have our, um, our Crop at Home 3 border dies available on HSN as well, and that's what the, I made with that. But then here we have the background for the, oh, those Everything I just cut is there, and then you add the photo to the center of it. So it's it's really Gorgeous. pretty, and it's very easy to work with, and except that I have some foam adhesive issues here. Um, we have borders and beautiful ways of creating so uh, a, an embellishment, right? So I would say, Suzanne, I don't know about you, but when, when I started scrapbooking, I never really thought about frames, right? I, I knew that I wanted to take the photo and we would cut the photos, but we weren't really embellishing around them. And so this die set is really going to give you that option. Well, what's fun about that too, as you can see, it absolutely draws your eyes right to the center where you want, right to the picture. Um, and I think, you know, the frames are just such a beautiful, beautiful extension of that. And guys, here's the thing. Anna's never done a kit like this before. I mean, this is so exciting to be able to have this in the show tonight because the variety of things you can do with it and the ways you see her layering with allow you just to use these in almost uh, in an impossible amount of ways. It's just so such a cool idea. And Anna, I know when we're working with your card kits too, you'd use some really fancy kind of frame-like embellishments in the background to build the look of your cards. So when you said, oh, this could be a five by seven card easily if you turn it this way or horizontal, horizontal, you immediately can picture and see that. Also, I will tell you, you'll be amazed how often you'll just use the concentric rectangles. I have found that having these are so handy for doing, again, little titles, little tags, take them back to stamps that you have, and probably you're going to find, especially an elongated one like this. So if you've got stamps, a whole bunch of like word stamps at home, and you want to make its own little frame or its own little, you know, rectangle around it, these will come in so handy. Same here with these little smaller ones that you see here. That's going to work great with a lot of stamps that you have to create, as you said, Anna, a little title um, frame or a title space. Does that, does that make sense? Yeah, and I, I, I was just doing that. I was creating the title for a scrapbook page by cutting that incredible uh, matte foil cardstock that we Thank offer you. here on HSN. And you see how the smallest of the concentric frames, this is the rounded corner, becomes the background for an embellishment. We've used uh, one of the smaller pieces to create exactly what we want for, look at this page, uh, Suzanne. I love having the this uh, photo, oh, right, wow. with the with all the frames. You oh, see frame wow. and frame and more frames. Okay. Where, of course, we're going to decorate here, and uh, we need a little title. It says hello, um, and then w this oh. is where you know we just all just celebrated National Scrapbook Day on Saturday, and we did that by creating our memories in paper, very much like this. And so when we've got something that is as precious as 
is this, we do want to commemorate these moments and having the right tools like our frame dies, um, any of our paper kits, or it makes it so simple to get this done in just a few passes through your impress machine or your die cutting machine to give yourself that, just that extra layer of embellishment. And by the way, we have a couple hundred of the Empress machines available. I know you saw it up on the screen. If you missed out, we'll pop that up there again. It is a beautiful embossing die cut machine. Um, so if you'd like to pick that up, that's actually back in stock. It's one of our most popular machines we do. And again, we'll pop the information up there for you. Once again, if you want to get the machine that you saw Anna working with. All right, these are limited. We knew going into our weekly deal drop, hopefully they will last all week. I don't think they'll last all day, to be honest with you, but this is such an incredible, incredible value. The other really beautiful thing about what Anna does with all their dyes is the quality is exceptional. These are really strong, they're really sturdy, and you have to make a great die to be able to get these intricate, intricate die cuts, these pieces. You have to make a really good die to get that kind of um, accuracy and that kind of detail to pop out instantly. And indeed, she really, really does. So I think this is a beautiful set to add to your collection. I personally believe you'll reach for it constantly. It's just gonna be that wow on the card or the wow finishing up a scrapbook page or the wow making a tag. Um, even if you did um, place setting cards out of this using the backgrounds as these frames, that would be incredible for that next holiday event that you're celebrating. All right, so we're gonna wrap up on that. That is our weekly deal drop. Also, I need to show you my little outfit of the day. This is the one that I chose to wear today. And it's from Miss Marla Ginsburg and the Marla Wing Collection. Isn't this cute? I've got her fabulous pants. I've got this really cute little top. I love how this is designed. I love a little pocket up here. So that's my top from Marla. It's $49.95 and three flex bays. We have my pants coming up next. There they are. These are, by the way, wildly comfortable. I've actually worn them twice on the air and I love them. And then even my shoes. Oh my gosh, talk about comfortable. A lot of us freak out thinking, I can't wear a heel anymore, but this is Clark's and they are unbelievably comfortable. So if you want a super duper cute heel, but you don't want to feel like you're you know, walking on like this on your tippy toes, I would highly recommend these shoes. They are really comfortable. Also check out our host closet. You can see what our hosts are wearing currently. Uh, check it out. You type in host closet on uh, our HSN page and you can see some of the outfits we've been wearing over the last couple days. It's kind of a cool way to shop the outfits that we have on. Okay, what's happening next? Let let me show you real quick. Number one, we're going to talk about a very limited and much loved art journal collection next. And I've got some sale items coming up. Join us for Summer Style Weekend. Two days featuring our biggest and newest names in fashion, footwear, and accessories. Level up with Jacqueline Smith, Iman, Birkenstock, the premiere of our Riveter handbags, and more. Enjoy special edition shows like Shop the Runway. Catch style tips and ideas. Summer Style Weekend, only on HSN. In honor of National Military Appreciation Month, HSN Cares is supporting the Foundation for Women Warriors, a nonprofit organization dedicated to honoring and empowering the women veterans community. The foundation works to enhance the personal and economic well being of veterans by providing financial education, professional development, and mentorship. Join us in support of our women veterans. In May, HSN Cares will match customer donations up to $75,000. Search Donate Now on hsn.com to learn more. HSN Cares, the heart of everything we do. We're making bigger even better with our supersize values, and they're available only at HSN. Supersize values are based on the price per ounce of the same item in a smaller size. However, they do not reflect a price at which HSN would sell the item. Have questions? Call us at 1-800-284-3900. Love watching HSN? Then take us with you in the HSN app. Everything on your TV is streaming live on your phone. Anytime, any place, we're always with you. Download the iPhone or Android app today.
Hey, you're watching HSN. I'm Suzanne Runyon and the incredible Anna Griffiths joining us this hour. We love her work. Um, just a little heads up in case you're channel surfing. Remember, it's a big crafting day. And what does that mean? Well, you can ship all of your crafting goodies all day long for one day only for only $7.50. So go ahead and check out, get through the whole process, keep checking out all day. And our systems will automatically switch everything to free shipping once you hit the $7.50 mark. So take advantage of it because we do not do that every day. And it's literally for one day today to get all your crafting dreams and make them come true in a very affordable shipping method. All right, this next item I really think is so unique, but unfortunately, guys, really, really limited. We only have less than 300 left of what's called the journal and sticker collection. So you get two journaling books, which I think are wonderful. You put ideas in here. I really love this because it's memories. It could almost act like a diary as well. So you get two of those. And then this is really cool. You get an entire hardbound book, absolutely chock full of stickers, these beautiful, gorgeous stickers. So you get an entire book of that, which is amazing. There's over 500 stickers just in the book alone. Plus you get the two journaling books to go with it. So Anna, I thought this was really interesting. For me, this is the first time I've ever seen this. And we have been together for many, many years now. Why did you decide to do something like it? Because it is really unique. Well, you know, we work with so much incredible art, right? And we, we make stickers for card making and scrapbooking. But I really wanted to approach uh, our HSN craft customer in a different way. How do we how do we use what we love? every single day, right? Creating an art journal is a way of, you know, it's it's almost like therapy for for us. Uh, we the, the slip case that we designed, this is gonna sit on, you know, on your bookshelf. You're going to see, wow, Anna's art journals. You see all three are gonna come inside this. And I love the fact that we've put together some of our most famous antique pieces of art in not only um, ivory uh, text weight stickers, but there's there's a washi sheet sticker. So in front of the text, so this the washi is, acts like vellum, so it has translucence to it. And then the text weight sticker is our ivory text. And then we've included this is what's really nice is that we've designed each of the sheets to work together in case you wanted to create a collage with the item uh, or the flower. And then we give you these labels that are pre printed with lines and tags and this is all kiss cut you just peel them off the sheets and 500 stickers goes a long long way Suzanne mm -hmm. so I'm going to show I'm going to show you how we have taken the art journal to a different level. So each one of our crafts team members was given a set of these and each person had a very different approach to how they wanted to work with the, the journal. So adding the stickers and talking about your favorite moments of tea, um, the designs can be, you know, oh, it wow. can be a distressed, uh, more me memorabilia. Um, if you love to do, um, um, distressed uh, things like with uh, rubber stamps you can create a, a more of a gift where pockets are okay. made with our 3d embossing folders it's so easy oh, to wow. um, create your own expression with this so maybe you want to you know add little pockets and on the inside you have things <laughs> it's it's a gift as well so this is really fun Suzanne and I think um, you know as I like to look at these this is what I I, I want to always do so I am taking the the ribbon uh, and to make sure that I know where I, I am in my journal and uh, you all you have to do is look in the sticker book for the design that's pre-printed on the page and then you can add it to the opposite page or continue to design with it so that you just gently peel these off the backer sheet now this would this one came out of a bound journal right so it, they don't come like this they come in the journal and you see this has got the ivory um, sticker on the on the background so that's not the washi 
But here, this is the washi paper, and this is really light. Again, this would be bound, and you do have to be a little careful in getting these off. Um, I, I, they, they, you don't want to tear them, but this is so beautiful. So if you're someone that is a, you know, an altered book fan, this, these are this, the washi stickers are just a, a fantastic way to go about working with these. And then if you take those labels, the, 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 um, the, these are like antique French labels, uh, and write on them, right? Maybe you want to keep keep a note every day to yourself, right? You inspire yourself uh, with the, with your notes. And every one of these is different oh, um, and it's just your own self-expression. You know what's neat about that too, Anna? I was thinking two things. One, if you love doing Bible journaling and you want to keep Bible yeah. verses in there or thoughts of the day. Another one would be old recipes. How many of you are lucky enough to have like old family recipes? Can you imagine collecting them all or making one book using the original ones and make copies copies of those and give to maybe your sister or someone you love the second recipe book. Wouldn't that be neat? Like I would love to get that, all the family recipes all in one book so we'd have and be able to use and treasure those. Okay, so now we're talking about 3D flowers. Okay, so personally, I am, I love botanicals. I love flowers. There's so many ways to use flowers and they can be for everything, whether it's sympathy to happy birthday to thank you or what have you. And what I really like is being able to create bouquets. And I love what Anna did with this. She's taken her famous florals and she does them the very best, very intricate and beautiful. And she's created a set of dies that you can play and layer with. And think about all the different papers you have at home. So whether you want to do beautiful foils, and we do have a foil pack floating around here somewhere. I saw it earlier. Or you want to do just other papers that you have at home for a completely different look, you're going to be able to have these dies to be able to do this. Also, don't forget about the Empress. I know she's going to work with it right now. We will pop that information up if you want to get the die cutting machine you're about to see. So this is beautiful and these are on sale today which is gorgeous. Obviously you have a passion for flowers. <laughs> I do. I, I have a I have a theme in my life. I can't have too many flowers at any given time. Uh, <laughs> but these dyes are so different, Suzanne, than than the ones that we see, you know, uh, on HSN because these are, th are what we call 3D. That means they have a technology that we've done to etch the design. We've taken an antique engraving, and now this is going to engrave all the details of the petals. It's going to emboss the details of the petals and it's gonna cut the outside shape of each of the flowers. We've also given you a secondary dye to layer on top of itself. So that's that rose that we were just looking at. And you see the level of the engraving it is second to none. So this is this little sample is showing you just in contrast, if you're cutting it out of matte foil in the gold and you go back and add the blooms in a second color, you get a, a very different look. And all of our die sets come with uh, ideas of how to put, to put these together if you're die cutting for the first time. I'm gonna show you how we would go about doing that. And I have lots of plates here uh, for some reason, but you would take, um, we have a, our, our um our Empress machine, our Empress mini machine, these plates are for the mini. And so you take that die and it goes face down into the paper that you're going to cut. And I'm using a little wax paper in between the die and the magnetic mat because that makes it actually go a lot faster um, in the cleanup. So that's like one of the tips. We're always uh, teaching people ways to do things faster and more efficient. But this is the, this is the top layer of, um, of that flower I was just showing you. And so you see that incredible detail that comes out. It looks, it's very lifelike. And these are just the tops of the flower. So um, we would add this on top of, of the stems. And so I have a card I can show you with these. Uh, this, is, this is a lot of fun. So we're starting, starting with something pretty on the base. And then that, uh, the, the cut that we just made, we, we, <laughs> nothing matches tonight, but um, you get the idea. Idea. So you have the big, the bloom and the smaller two bloom. And then we just, all we have to say is you're simply the best. And then we have a beautifully embellished card. Um, and 
if you're working with this for the first time, you're saying, okay, what is different about my dyes uh, with from Anna Griffin? It's this 3D technology. It engraves the art and it does it in a single pass. We don't even have to put the plates back through the machine to get all of that elaborate detail. And for me, I, you know, I just can't, I can't go back. I can't go back to the plain ones anymore, <laughs> but I, I want all of our dyes to be 3D because I love this level of detail. Yeah, you know, it cuts a lot of time out too, because sometimes if you're trying to get an, um, an embellished look, you have to run it through first and then you got to run it back through and then it never works. And this is really tricky to be able to pull something off. You don't realize technically how difficult it is to make that two, two moment experience happen in one pass. By the way, if you want foil cardstock, because you're seeing her work with it, we have coming up and it also works with a beautiful set that we have in just a couple of minutes. We have an entire pack. This is 60 pieces of four by nine. So if you are looking for beautiful foiled cardstock, you can ask about that. I know we had the Adam up there, up there a moment ago. We're also gonna use this on another unique set coming up that I want you to see. It's all slim line. So that's gonna be coming up as well in just a second. Um, here's the thing, on this one specifically though, what I love is you can use all those paper scraps you have at home to create magic. And everything looks great with florals. I mean, who does? I make a lot of bouquet style cards. Uh, because florals are just so happy and welcoming and who doesn't love a flower arrangement, right? So this again has that really unique, oh, that's a beautiful card. I love the one on the left. Thank you. So yeah, I was pretty. just working with this. I, this, uh, this is showing uh, a solid cardstock where we can sand off the top of it to give you the detail oh, and then cool. go back and add that secondary flower on top. Great idea. And there you go with all those layers uh, all in one card. I love that. All right, so we're going to wrap up on this one, guys. It's on sale for the very first time. We're at $34.95. If you love flowers, if you love bouquets, I think this is another one that you're going to reach for constantly, kind of like our weekly deal drop that just find it as, oh, man, I'm going to grab those little flowers and add them to a tag even. It would be beautiful. Okay, so we're going to move on to this next kit, which, again, slimline. So we love the slimline concept. Like, what is that? Well, mostly cards are like 5 by 6s 4 by 3s Slimline is literally the length of a business envelope and recently has become wildly popular to create these elongated cards. They're very fun. Obviously, you can go this direction if you want to as well. So Anna, as she does so brilliantly, came up with a concept of being able to create the 3D, once again, the 3D concept, French slimline concentric dies. So Anna, again, this is really magnificent. You kind of went for the wow in this one. Yeah, right. Well, I always go for the wow, only because I like more and more and less is a bore. So uh, <laughs> as you're working with these um, concentric dies, you're able to create this kind of detail, building from the bottom up, shadow layer, main die, concentric dies in the center. Now, this is perfect for just about any style or occasion of card, because if you're going from birthday to anniversary, this long slimline card is the perfect format, right, for all the occasion. It even holds money, right? If you're someone that loves to send a little cash to your niece or nephew, um, this is the kind of card that you want to make. So I'm going to use the the my um, our brand new plates that we have on HSN. This is the 13-inch uh, long plate, and we're going to cut that metallic cardstock with that outer frame. And this is the bigger of the, the biggest die except for the shadow layer in the set. Uh, we call it French because it reminds me of those antique uh, picture frames, those beautiful ornate, they're usually made out of bronze or, um, you know, they're just, they're gold, right? So look at this. We are able to get all of that that's, in a single pass. That's gorgeous. And and oh. it just, I, I, I wish I could make that, you know, every single day, but this is where you're <laughs> going to start. Um, your card base, the shadow layer in a companion uh, card stock. And then if you add a little foam adhesive to the back of that frame, we went and we cut, um, we cut with the concentric die to get this, the frame to happen. Uh, meaning we cut out the center of it. If you're watching for the first time, you're going, what is she doing? And how did she do that? So many people find us at, 
at, at this hour, Suzanne, I can't tell you over the over this past weekend, so many people shared with us that uh, they had found us on HSN in the middle of the night <laughs> while changing channels, and they and and they were hooked. It was like wow, it was the most beautiful things that they had ever seen, Aww. and and I was like, oh, okay, that gets you into crafting, absolutely. But I'm gonna right. make another one just so that we can show you. I mean, how versatile. This is, so you, again, if you were making a slimline card, this is four inches by nine and a quarter, just to give you the idea of the size. It is that number 10 business envelope, the one that we put the checks in the mail or the invoices in the mail um, as a business. Uh, I love that shape. Um, our stationery, our letterhead is that uh, shape and size. Um, and this is me just building, again, all the way, so we've cut one, so two, pretty. three, four, five different times. So wishing you a very happy birthday. Of course, we need a little flower or two on this card to make it as perfect as it can possibly be. And here we go, right? That's all this That's all it took. And yes, absolutely perfect for, um, maybe this is for a sweet 16. You're thinking about, all right, Gorgeous. I wanna just make sure that my mom knows that she is loved on Mother's Day coming up next weekend. Now, you see, we just cut several of those and made almost like a book out of the die. So you, it, this is up to you. This is using the exact same set of dyes and we get completely different looks just by changing up the paper. Also, you could do it horizontally. Yes, you could very easily. Yeah, it's, gonna be, it's a really unique card. It's very different, people. It's very unexpected. Um, also, you know, because of the size of the Santa, I could see you actually working this into some scrapbooking pages. That might be kind of gorgeous. Oh yeah, it would make an incredible title, background of a title, um, just because of the length of the die cut, right? You see, it's it, for a Gorgeous. wedding album, this would be beautiful on the front of a scrapbook album. There, there's just so many ways to incorporate a die set like this. You can cut this die cut in half and use it on a card. There's just no end to the creativity once you start working with these. Yeah, and again, I hope you can really appreciate how ornate these incredible three-dimensional dies are. Like, it is a mini miracle to be able to take a plain old piece of cardstock, run it through your machine, and have that wow. Like, oh my gosh. And you didn't have to do any of the work. You just let Anna's dies do it. And the nice thing about having a die collection is they never go bad. Like, you don't run out of them ever, and you get to use them for years to come. So, really beautiful set on sale. Also, you guys are loving the cardstock. This, again, is a slim line size. In this case, you get 60 pieces. They're all four by nine. These are stunning. It's card stock and all these incredible, incredible metallic colors. Just really a stunning collection. And again, those kind of go-tos where you just want to use the dyes you just picked up or basically the rose dyes would have worked, the floral dyes we had a few moments ago. That's pretty easy too. All right, so I just want to make sure you understand we have that available for under $20, which is pretty darn fabulous. Okay, so now we're going to move on to our last and final item of this hour. And this is um, 20 cards that and I always say 20 cards with plenty of leftovers when you buy an Anna kit. So you say, oh, I can make 20 cards. That gr that's great. But by the time you're done, you still, she gives you so many goodies. You have leftover fun stuff to work with for other projects. All comes in a box. And this is a really cool concept because you're going to do a flower pot that pops up. All right, Anna, this is fun. <laughs> This is so great, Suzanne. You know, we started tonight with the Simply series, the the 12 cards in the box with everything you need. This is the uh, this is the advanced version of card making because in this kit, right, there are over 200 pieces to make those 20 cards, but they're not just any cards. They're cards that open from the bottom. They're folded at the top and they're beautiful, but they're printed on the outside and the inside. And we give you all oh, the things wow. to make that happen in the middle. Oh my now, this gosh. is a 
This is a 360 wow. degree pop-up card that one would pay a great deal of money for all assembled. Uh, what is neat about this is that you get the experience of that which we do so well, which is to engineer the way in which this happens. We make it a color-coded system where you, there's a series of tabs that everything is die cut. This gets added to the inside of the card and the pot it, itself is made by just turning this down and gluing it together. There's a little support on the inside that works just for you. And so this is it, Suzanne. This is so cool. You pick your flower pot color and then we give you in expert technical instruction inside the box. Let me just show you. It, whether you learn by watching or you learn by reading, we take you through this step by step with the system that we've invented. It's a series of tabs that you add adhesive to and you fold under and then you embellish. And so everything in the box is color coded and it's it's easy as A, B, C. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you how, like, so you would have decorated your card uh, on the outside. We tell you on the inside of the card where to put the flower pot. You add your own adhesive to the center of this and what's important important is that uh, you uh, you will make this color coordinated. So you see we have the purple, there's pink, there's yellow, and then as you make this, we're gonna add the um, this adhesive to both sides. And then we, all we're gonna do is take this part of this and add an embellishment to the center. And you use the foam adhesive that's included and you just connect it to the little divider on the inside. And we get so many of these wonderful bouquets that you can make them uh, work on the front and the back. So a 360 degree experience. Now I have cards that we have made that are really out outstanding. So you see how every time we open one, you get a different look. So if your favorite color is green, we have green cards. And if your favorite color, oh, then we have more green cards, but uh, you, you see what we've done is given you an entire garden's worth of embellishments. You know what I, what I call all those cards, Anna? What do you call them? The ones you <laughs> never throw away. <laughs> yes. Those exactly. are keepers. We're going to call those keeper cards. <laughs> just, I love keeper that. Cards. It's just gorgeous. And again, you make 20 of the most incredible cards. People are like, oh, I can't believe you made this card. And you're like, oh, it was nothing. Anna, we love you. I'll see you throughout the day. And I know you're going to rejoin me. We have a huge hour coming up at 8 p.m. tonight, right? Yes, yes, I'll see you in just a few hours. All right, honey, take care, get a little sleep, and I'll see Bye. you guys back at 7 o'clock to 9 o'clock.